Developing at noon, we're working to learn more details about a man and woman shot and killed at a busy intersection. We brought you this story's breaking overnight on the morning news. Now, deputies say they found the victims late last night along Orange Blossom Trail, right where it connects with Lee Road and John Young Parkway. News 6's Ezzie Castro tells us what she's learned from the investigation. Deputies say this is the intersection where a man and a woman were shot to death last night. A witness that we spoke to today says that he was in the middle of grabbing a cigarette from a neighbor when he heard the gunshots. As soon as they opened the door and I stepped in the door, we heard the shots. All of us dropped to the ground. Kenny Webster says he was at the Raceway Motel here on the corner of Orange Blossom Trail and John Young Parkway when he heard multiple gunshots last night. Deputies say it was right before 11 o'clock that a man and a woman were shot in the middle of the intersection. And they come tell me to come out the room. Webster tells us deputies thought he was the suspect at first and was placed in custody for about five hours. Why did they think you were the suspect? I don't know, because I guess because I was like the only person walking around when the shots fired. I told them I heard the shots, but I wasn't there. I was in the neighbor's room. We spotted several shell casings on the ground around two cars as investigators continue to search for evidence. Detectives were working for over eight hours processing the scene, though they have not said what led up to the violence. We didn't even hear no cars crashing or nobody peeling out or anything. We just heard five shots and then it was silent. Now, deputies haven't told us anything about possible suspects, but if you do have any information about what happened out here last night, make sure to give the sheriff's office a call. In Orange County, Ezzie Castro, getting results, News 6.